G'day guys, Josh here. Hope you guys are having a great day so far. So, you know, you got those guild tasks, okay? You got the fishing task, you got the uh, excavating car task, and what's just said, you got the hunting task as well. Before you do anything, before you do anything, just don't, don't go to a random fishing spot and just fish there for a bit, okay? Because you could be doing this completely utterly wrong and you could be, well, just to use a term from the old RuneScape days, you could be actually harming your efficiency quite hard. So let's just get into the game for you guys as well. So yes, you got one of these, okay? So basically you got one of these quests, you can see here, the fishing for arcane fries, get some bloodstones as well. The reason why you want to pay attention to where you're fishing for this, you can fish for this anyway, you can fish for Northern or whatever it is, whatever is easier, whatever is closer, okay? But there's a reason why you want to fish in your current tier. So if you're in tier one, you don't need to worry about this, okay? There's nothing, no fusion mats for you to worry about. So don't worry about it. You're all good. You're all good. You're all fine. But if you're in tier two or tier three, so Punica or Yawn or anything like that, or even in Phaeton as well, you want to be fishing in the tier two and tier three areas. Here I'm in Yawn. Yawn is a very good area to do so. And this is what we're going to be doing so far. So we're going to give you a big example of fishing as well. And hopefully we get a gold fish so we can get the fusion materials quickly. But the main reason why you want to farm here, the fish is are uh, the exactly the same here. Okay, they're exactly the same. But the main reason why you want to farm here as well is for a certain blue fish called a Chaldea fish and Aurea fish as well, which will make fusion mats later down the track. This is the same for hunting because you get the Aurea meat and the Chaldea meat that you can turn into fusion mats. Same for the excavating because you get the runes, the Chaldea and Aurelia stuff, which also get the things as well. And as you can see here, you can do the fishing challenge, you get your 55 arcane fries, but at the same time be fishing for mats in the other areas as well, which are incredibly important for your alts and also super duper important if you're in tier three and trying to get deep into tier three, especially if you get to 14, 15 for Voltan. It's incredibly important that you're doing this because you need to get the fusion materials. You don't want to be wasting life energy doing extra fishing when you could have done it actually doing the fishing challenge. If it's for mining, logging, and uh, mining, logging, and I don't know, the, the thing, other maps, uh, the other profession, or foraging, that's right. You don't have to pay hold to this at all. The uh, the foraging, mining, all those other maps are basically the same across tiers. So if you've done that, it's like, ah, oh, don't worry about it. You're fine. You're A-OK. -okay. You haven't done anything wrong. Um, you know, as I said, do, with the mining and all that stuff, you do Lake, you do lake Bar, you do Magic Monastery, and... You know, that's pretty much it. With vlogging, you can just pretty much do it anyway. In fact, I just do it in Paducah because it's a lot easier and there's a lot more trees. And you can do it in Lullaby Island as well. Lullaby Island is actually a good place for all of them. But either way, as I said here, farm in the tier areas, okay? Farm in the tier areas that you're at because it's better off catching extra caldo fish, extra oreo fish, so you can turn those into uh, fusion materials if you need those fusion materials in the future because you don't want to do extra fishing, extra hunting, or anything like that just to get Matt's bit later. Anyways, guys, that's a quick update, quick guide. Make sure you're doing these things here. Otherwise, it's going to look up pretty badly for you as well. And so it's a bit of a buggery at the moment. We haven't caught any yet, but you do catch them. You do eventually catch the cow deer fish from these areas as well. And you know, we'll, you know, you know what? We'll probably show. We'll probably do this video until I've actually caught a cow deer fish because you can catch them on any of them. Okay, it doesn't, it doesn't have to be a rare. See, as you can see here, you do catch a cow deer and. You know, if you're doing 55, you're going to catch about 40 or so, 40 or 50. And it's enough for about 150 mats for Caldea. And I'm going to say right now, 150 mats for Caldea is definitely enough to get you through tier 2. Okay, especially the stronghold honing mats being in. This is mainly for old guides as well. Araya, you want to farm as much as you can, basically. You want to farm as much as you can of those so you can convert them in a bit later. Anyways, guys, hope you guys enjoyed this video. And hope you guys have a wonderful, wonderful day.